Well, good evening. I'm, I'm posting another video since my last uh, Odyssey at Lowe's. And so far, as you see here, my bike is gone. So, so I'm glad it's out of here. And so I'll tell you something right now what's on my mind tonight. And, and it's this about Big O. I have uh, followed a certain person on Big O and um, and she's ha she's out of work she's a broadcaster who used to be in news years ago and she herself um, has turned to Big O to build up her base a bit because what she does now she's a freelancer doing esports and all these other um, gaming sports venues and um, she used to be in, she used to work at IGN and all that, but I'm not going to give her a name. But the problem is, she is um, on this Big O, and one thing I don't like about Big O, and there's a lot of other people on it, all they're doing is they're buying friendship. I don't believe in buying friendship. I believe in having friendship the way God intended through love, trust, and respect. You've got to trust each other. But the problem is, if you think it, you have to go out and buy these little gifts like maces and shields and, and coins and beans and all this other crap that is associated with Big O, <clears throat> you're destroying the whole idea and concept of what friendship is all about. Friendship starts from God. God made friendship so that everybody can feel a sense of belonging. Whether it be in a church, whether it be in a uh, sports club, whether it be someplace where people meet. And unfortunately we can't do that with this COVID virus. But there's one thing. We can pray for one another. This whole thing about going on social media, <clears throat> thinking that you're going to win friends over a, a, a app like Big O, I feel that Big O is the biggest waste of one's money. And on top of that, here's another thing. I'm taking something from Mark Twain when he said this about the British Empire. He said that it was one of the biggest swindles of mankind ever. Well, Big O is the biggest swindle of mankind ever. And these millennials and these other people don't have the value system as we uh, uh, baby boomers and other ones, even before that, my mother and father. They had, be had those values and they brought them down to us, you know, passed them down. So this bit, and I want to warn everybody, don't get into Big O because it is just another scam to take your money because as far as I'm concerned, there's better things you can do with your money. There's thousands of people out here <clears throat> out of work because of this COVID-19. That's sad. And I'm, and I'm, I'm and, I, and I tell you, God has brought this on this country to bring him back to him. God wants us to come back to him. We got to get away from this nut, nutsy foolishness. So I'm going to tell you, you know, um, give your money to your local church. Um, support your local church. Support like other places like Operation Blessing on CBN. Do that. Because you're going to do better for the world with that than you're going on Big O and dropping coins to a bunch of girls out there you think you're going to hook up with or make friends because those people will only want your money and then that's about it and you're going to walk away poorer than what you were. So, I'm just telling you this everybody because Hey, 
you got to do right by all. And that's how I feel about it. And I'm sorry there's going to be some people that's going to disagree with me. I don't care. Right's right and wrong's wrong. So, there you go. Just a thought for the evening. Thank you.